Hey guys and welcome to this very crazy farming strategy on how to get almost 4 million money before round 40. You don't need to use any powers for this but I'm using some tech bots because I'm very lazy. It also works on every single map and here's how to do it. Step number one, as always, put on your free dart monkey. Your next step is to place down Ben and after that make sure to build 5 two zero zero farms. I think now is the perfect time to mention that I used full monkey knowledge for this, but it's not necessary and you can do it without any monkey knowledge, it will just be a little bit slower. I'm also going to cut out every single time when I use Ben's ability, I think you can figure it out on your own because it's not really hard, just use it when you feel like you need a little bit more popping power and that's it. After upgrading the last farm to 200, make sure to build one more dart monkey for extra popping power in round 17. The next step is really simple, just get a 002 discount village in range of all your 5 farms. Oh I guess I had to mention that earlier that you have to place all the farms in range of a village, but whatever. At round 20 upgrade one of your farms to 202 and sell it, also sell Ben and the dart monkey and build a downdraft heli. Now we have to use the bug, put the downdraft heli as close as possible to the entrance of the track so it can infinitely stall the round. After getting all the bananas from your banana farms, upgrade all of them to 202 and sell them. Now you should be able to afford your support Shinook. At this point you just need to stall the rounds as long as possible so you can use 3 crates each round. Guys before you stop the infinite stalling make always sure your abilities are off cooldown, this is really important. Now keep doing this until you can afford your tier 5 heli. Oh and by the way the next step is the most important step, just use my creator code PANJI for extra 10% cash generation and to support me for free. After getting your tier 5 heli make sure to not use the marine ability because it will stop your stalling. Now for extra cash generation make sure to get a monkey city in range of your tier 5 heli. And now the next step is really simple, just get as many support shinooks as you can in range of your monkey village. As you can see I used a ton of tech bots because I was way too lazy to press the ability button like a hundred times. Ok welcome to round 28 aka the first round where we will have a lead balloon. To kill some of the lead balloons we are going to get a sniper, make sure the sniper is 100 and on strong. You can sell the sniper after like 5 hits. Make sure to not keep it because it will stop the stalling. Oh and yeah at this point just keep building more and more support chinooks. For the lead balloons in round 30 make sure to buy another sniper and sell it after 5 hits. Just keep building support chinooks now until the end of round 31.
Now it's the time to build your tier 5 farms. Make sure to start with the monkey nomics one because it's by far the best one here. Get a monkey wall street as well and make sure to put it in range of a monkey city. Last but not least, get one 5 to 0 farm and make sure it's in range of a monkey city. Now make sure you have a monkey city in the center of the map and get a tier 5 ultra boost and ultra boost your monkey city at least 9 times. You can use the ability 3 times per round. You should also get an overclock and make sure to overclock your 5 to 0 farm as much as possible. Here is a little trick on how to save a lot of money. And I'm talking about the Sallycopter. You just have to get a boat and upgrade it to 004 and then you have to use your tier 5 helicopter and pick up the boat. Now move your tier 5 heli around if you want to sell stuff and you get a lot of extra sell back because you have the boat inside. After ultra boosting your monkey city in the center of the map 9 times, make sure to replace all of your farms with BRF farms and get the biggest monkey opolis possible. Now after getting your monkey opolis, make sure to replace everything with support chinooks again. And now you just have to farm for 5 more rounds. In the end you can use a helicopter again and sell everything and you should end up with about 4 million dollars before round 40. This is by far the craziest farming strategy in Bruce Tower Defense 6. You can get a VTSG, the strongest tower in the game, on round 39 and you still have 2.5 million dollars left. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you guys tomorrow for the boss guides. Bye.